Oh, we have so a somebody wants to game. play. All right. You're taking two stones. Okay, yeah, yeah. so what to do? Um, For two stone handicaps, I've had a lot of good luck with a 4-4. Four four. Mm -hmm. um, so the, the idea is to take the empty corner first, right? Yeah, yeah. It doesn't have to be only Hoshi. You you can try a, a different move. You can even try a 5-5 five five to see how he acts, but <laughs> it's fine to play Sun Sun. It's okay to play R4, Q3. Hoshi usually have very simple uh, Josekis, so you already got two Hoshis. Try a different move. Any other move. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take the 3-4 then. Good. If you want to play aggressive, you could attack his corner. Now it's too late. He made a Shimari. But that's a little bit too slow for white. White should be more active, especially when he's giving two handicap. And it's also sure. reverse Komi. So, black to play. So I guess I could make a Chinese shape on the right side that's with uh, like R9. Almost every move you play right now, it's, it's really big. You can make a Shimari Q5, Q6, R5, R6. You can play an extension in front of his uh, Shimari something like K16 or K17. Tengen, it's an interesting option too. Looks uh, playable. <laughs> but when he has a Shimari like this, C14, he's facing the direction of K16, uh, K17, K16. So you, sh you should okay. play K16 or K17. Just to I'll take away yeah, his extension. Yep. And like this, you also develop uh, in the top, so... You have stones all over the board. Hmm. Yep. <clears throat> Whew. A low approach, huh? Yeah, it's quite uh, trendy, huh? Nowadays. <laughs> so my top right stone wants to extend downward as well. and then... So you consider a pincer? Yeah, I'm considering a pincer. Mm -hmm. Like maybe uh, R8 or R9. R9 is possible, the ones... yeah. It's played quite a lot. You can play a tighter one, like Q7, R7, it's playable. R8, Q8. You can you can simply play O4 or P4. All the moves are good. But if you want to play a pincer, just R9. Play right. a loose one. Mm-hmm. This guy plays extremely fast. Yep. Uh, so P3, I think, works? Yeah, P3. Don't let your corners around it. <clears throat> and then I'm always not sure about the if continuation. It, if you want to push or jump, it's one or of those two moves. O3 and 3. Okay. I'll just push. Somebody suggested a cut. <laughs> yeah, push and, and then you gotta jump to be one step ahead in this fight, M3. Okay. And he, he has some kind of wall, but the wall is facing your... Oh, wow, the push is strange. I guess I can just yeah. block. Play, playing the push, it's uh, an Aji Keshi. He's ruining his own cotrets and eliminating the Aji in that area. Now there is only one move. It's L3. Yeah, yeah. get ahead. Now you can think about some moves. Mm -hmm. uh... Like two of them, locally. J well, J3 doesn't look that great. I could Hane... Yeah, Han Hane K4, Nobi K3. But Hane is good because mm -hmm. when he pushes from behind, you start going on the fourth line. And if he cuts, you will just Atari, protect L2. And then, oh wow, this guy heard me. Is he on Skype too? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So just K2, right? Uh, J, J3 here, not K2. You want oh, us around? Okay. If you play down. K2, he will go out. And then L2. Uh-huh. Because you want to take away Liberty. Atari Connect. It looks ugly, 
when you play a move like L2, especially after this Atari. Mm -hmm. But his two stones, okay now, four stones, they are not so happy now. So what <laughs> to do? To try to kill them. Um, it doesn't look like I can Ane again, so maybe extend to H3? H3, yeah. And? And... Hmm, can I Hane now? If you Hane, he will go Atari, J4, then cut G3, then capture F2, mm -hmm. so... So that doesn't work either. Simply get ahead. It's like, yeah, extending again. <clears throat> Keep going, Nobi, because the idea is to um, have six on the second line, which is dead. So let's see here. I can actually Ane now, right? Uh, pak, pak, atari, cut, atari, cut. No need, you can nob again. And then you hunt. Oh. Okay. If he pushes once again and you block, then he's got six in, uh, on the second line. But here, you can still kill in a few moves. So I can push to ET. Push first, yeah. And then I can, uh, clamp? Yeah. At C2? Right. So one zero for you. Oh. He's trying a call, but it doesn't work. What to do? Um, I can extend a B two. Right. And if he plays a B three, you just turn B one and it's Atari, Dame Tsumari, and game over. Now what? Uh, just turn to B3? Yeah. Poo, how fast this guy died. Teach him the ladder. He shouldn't, he shouldn't <laughs> cut K3. Uh-huh. Desperate Atari. Good bottom side. <laughs> yeah, that, that works for me. That's the cross. Symbol. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so he played into my pincer, so yeah. I usually just kick him. P17? Okay. Yeah. Very good. I wonder why this guy is giving you two handicap. That, that's oh, it's just... the default, yeah. Auto match. Yeah. That... And now where to protect? Just XQ. Low or high? I... Um, I think I can play high. Right, to put more pressure on those two stones. Mm-hmm. Hmm, that's ambitious. Yeah. Two options, or actually three. But the plan is to separate them. Yeah, I can either drop to P18. Yeah. If, if you yeah, play R16 bad. or... The players on IGS, they're not displayed on the screen. Uh, They are. I'm an AQ, but uh, Cornell is a European six don, ah, and he's I, giving me a lesson. Yeah, I, and then I think the, the question was uh, about the players on the server. I I feel I don't know. You're all oh, right. The player I'm playing against is a a six Q. Yeah. So we are sandbagging a little <laughs> bit. <laughs> I didn't really suggest any move before you said something. So, hmm, interesting. Play by white, but he's not completely alive. What he's trying to do is to to force you play S14, and then he goes up, and then he can cut you one way or the other. So, what else can you do? Can play R15. When no, when you play work. when you play R15, he can pull back S16, then you block S14, and he lives in the corner, or he can go S14, mm -hmm. then you play S16, and he comes out. R12 and later eventually he connects at S17. So you better just play okay. something to surround him and force him leave small in the corner and then chase the two stones on the outside. Go for um, 
uh, compensation. Mm, so R14, R14 starts yeah. this around. Yeah. And that makes me strong. Exactly. Gets cut. And I'll block. <laughs> <clears throat> Hmm. Interesting. Two may go time. So yeah, if you, I'm if you win a few, this shape. If you win a few games, probably you become a seven or an AQ plus. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I'm seeing the shape point at S eighteen. Uh, oh, you you can no. That's a that's a good point. But let's see if you can push first and then play S eighteen, and then connect under. It's so it's it's a, it's a bit it's a bit risky though. Puck, mm. puck. The problem is, if you try S eighteen and then you connect under, he will cut you at P sixteen and then he will save everything. But anyway, push R sixteen one time. Okay. Mm, then let's see. If you play S eighteen. He connects, then you Hane. Ah, you can't really kill him, as long as he has the IG of uh, Q17. Ah, uh, okay. So we leave it like that for Cotrets. And now you're center, mm -hmm. so play some big points. There are several um, places. I'm looking... Yeah, I'm looking at my single stone on the at the top and mm -hmm. thinking maybe making a base to the left so extend somewhere around towards his shimari right yeah 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 that's good like uh g17 yeah that's perfect no rush with moves like s18 you can use all those mm -hmm. moves as quadrats that's a pretty good extension so he's limiting your wall on the left side <clears throat> But you can start attacking the wall on the bottom side. Oh, yeah. Hmm. I'm not even sure how to attack something like that. Uh, <laughs> um, I guess I could jump up from my R9 stone. Yeah. And just look at the big surround. Exactly. Maybe like O9 or... Maybe even maybe even farther. Even O eight something, it, which is connected to R nine and takes away uh, his jump potential or extension. Okay. Also, from this move, you can push Q four. Then you peep uh, P six. You can also peep L six. Ah, he wants to save those stones now. But those are still a target, more or less. Let me see something if you play the P. Yeah, you can attack those three stones. But you can think about attacking the wall more. His, his R5 can slide S3 or extend R7. Yeah, O8 looks artistic. Mm -hmm. It's an O gamer. So <laughs> you, you can play R4, just uh, Kosumi, to see if he goes up or down, Hane. Just make sure okay. he doesn't have a a base or room to extend. And then also, oh wow, he's very heavy now. Then you can try another move, similar to 08, to surround everything, more or less. I was looking at uh, like L8 or L7. You can try K7. Because it's K7. pretty much... Oh, the cap, yeah. yeah. You're trying to surround him, but also keep some distance, so... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think if I just stay ahead of him, maybe H7. H... yeah, H7 is good. One space jump. Yep. And even if you don't kill this group immediately, he might be able to leave very small, but you can peep one time L6, threatening the cut and put more pressure on the group. You become very strong in the middle with all those jumps, and the three stones in the top may die naturally. 
So now surround everything. How to surround this G5 group? Uh, F6 looks mm -hmm. like a good spot. Yeah. So he's trying to go out. So I can just no be at N8. N8 surround, yeah. Then what? Now you want to play a move to surround him, but don't really help him much. Keep some distance again. Yeah, L9 looks L9 okay. Kema, yeah. Double Kema. Mm -hmm. So this is just, just I need just, to go up at K8. Just block. J8 or K, ah oh, yeah, K8. Oh. No, no, it's K8, sorry. I misread the coordinate. <laughs> and I can Atari cut, this. Cut, yeah. Cut where you can cut. Hang on a second. That's an interesting uh, connection. Park, park, park. How about turn first, 07? Let him have one stone and feel good about it. Okay. Because if he, if he captures that stone, you play 06 in center. He needs to take it. Hmm, he plays this one. You can still play 06. Because he has no eyes. No, not Atari. Just 06. Ah, oh, Atari is such a bad moving go. You, you could play you could play <laughs> 06 with the idea of connecting K6. Because playing Atari, ah. when you connect 06, he can make twice. So... When you just play 06, he takes the stone, then you play N5, he makes one eye, then you play R7 and he dies. Now, if you play 06, he makes twice at N5. If you play any other move, you can just leave it like that. It's okay. Oh, okay. It's no big deal. He leaves small with two eyes. So now, those three stones in the top, they seem like dying by themselves. Nothing to do about it. You don't need to attack. Uh, come on, Skippy. <laughs> That's my uh, be Sean. That's okay. That yeah. The chat loves dogs. <laughs> so great. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, how about something on the left side? Uh, at this point, the the cap looks really good at E ten to me. E, E, then, uh, that, that's a cap on the left side, okay, possible. I was thinking something like uh, E14, but E, E10 it's playable too. Also, you can uh, you can oh, just okay. invade C16 to see how he reacts and try to leave on the left side. Or you can invade C12 right away, because you're pretty strong on the left side. With moves like E10 mm -hmm. or E14, we actually help him uh, reinforce the left side. But you become very strong in the center, so that's also good. Challenge him a little bit. Let's see what he plays when you go C12. C12. Yeah, between those two stones. Okay. I think he's standing too far in that area. He should go just C11 to respect your thickness on the left. Oh, this attach is so bad for white. Because usually I... you end up with a Ponuki in center. So you got to hunt it one so... way or the other. Which yeah. one? Yeah, that one. Good. Then D13. And then he'll try to link under. If he goes out and you connect, it's too good for black. Go out. Mm. Yeah, I just extend. Nice. Uh, let's see here. You have two options. You can turn E14 or you can push F13. What to... mm, I like the turn. Yeah, it's good. If he doesn't answer in the corner, and he doesn't, how can you use the edge of um, this loose corner? Yeah, it looks. Looks there like. There is I a Tesuji here. It's quite nice. Hit the C16 point and cut him apart. Yeah, C16. And then if he tries to connect with D16, you just hunt under at B14, and he's in pain. You don't have to cut him here. Try to link under. 
and then he'll probably just play an ugly empty triangle connection at d15. If he hane, what to do? Uh, then... Oh wait, something is yeah. weird with my camera. Yeah, if he hunted, I could Atari the two stones and then... Yeah, then the take the Atari, then kill the one stone, yeah. Right. I'm just <clears> going <throat> to extend and connect. Very good. And here? Um, I'm going to make a tiger's mouth. Keep the pressure on the group? Yeah. Good. So it doesn't have eyes yet. One more honey in the corner, or what? Mm, I could get away with that. Mm, it's good to play honey. To prevent the Atari at A17. Yeah. That's how you attack uh, and you, you try to remove the base first. And when he tries to go out, which he does, pom pom. Huh, he dies in a few moves, huh? How can you surround this? Uh -huh. Try to set up a net of some sort. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking at, <laughs> I'm looking at H15. It's really Mm. I don't know. That I don't know anything about away. this camera I'm using. So, I think <laughs> I clicked uh, somewhere on uh, the option of following my face, and yeah, it, it exactly. does some interesting zooms from time to time. I'll study that later. Uh, which move <laughs> you, you were saying? H15. Mm, you gotta push first. Maybe G G16, and then surround him. With oh, okay. game H14. Because, yeah, it. if you play G14, he will push, push, Atari, Atari, and goes down. But now mm -hmm. it's difficult for him to cut you. And he just has to struggle to live somehow. Tough game for White. Look. Yeah, for sure. Is uh, getting uh, good at being surrounded and killed. That's a new skill White develops today. <laughs> <laughs> How to get smashed every sequence. So Atari M6, it's something not to play in the future. Mm -hmm. What now? One second. Let me just. Uh... Oh, the drop down. There we go. That's better. Let me see what people see on the stream. Oh, okay. Oh, things just changed all of a sudden. Sorry. Wait. Oh, it's back again. Okay, you're good. <laughs> nice. So, <clears throat> how to to chase that group more? Um. Hmm. I think I could play something like E18. Mm. But that that's, I don't think that works. That's a bit too ambitious, but looks like a vital point. You you want to capture that stone at C18, but then he will go G18 and drop mm -hmm. down. So let's see, honey, honey. How about you just go G18, and if he blocks, you take the stone. And if he plays C19, no, not F18. You should just oh. no be G18, because now, you, yeah, nice. now when you play G18, he plays C18. <laughs> ah, you you gave him eyes again, like uh, in the middle. Okay, right. that's nice. Sorry, <laughs> I misread it. You you could G18 or even E18. Okay, but now we gotta pay attention. Because you're a little bit in trouble on the left side. Ah. Uh, so. First of all, how about pip d9? Try, try to attack him here a little bit. Oh, okay. Too nice indeed. <laughs> Everyone's, saying, <laughs> Everyone's saying I'm too nice, yeah. Mm, it happens. You have to live with a group on the left side. 
So either play g14 or go b12. g14 trying to connect first, it's an option. But b12, you just make eyes. Uh, <clears throat> so the idea, the idea in the B12. top was to go g18, and then from g18 you can jump e18 and you're connected. And when he blocks f18, you capture the stone in the corner c18, and he only has room for one eye. So with a move like g18, you could kill right away, f18, right, right. let him live. It happens. So <laughs> b, b12. b12 is the right one. Anyway, you killed enough on the bottom, so you're you're leading by a lot. But it's never enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you played B11? Now B12 anyway. Am I misreading everything? <laughs> like, I'm misreading the numbers. I apologize. At least, I was this, fiddling yeah, with... Yeah, this kind of move is not such a big minus. It's okay. It's just that when you play B11 and he blocks B10, it's very easy for him to jump to C7. Yeah, it's okay to misread a little bit. Now what? He's trying to be aggressive. <clears throat> Gosh, just I... play simple. Yeah, I mean, I can just connect. You can connect J17, and if he cuts, you net him uh, K15. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I think I know what's wrong here. Uh, put some pressure. I can just turn. Yeah, J14. Yeah. Hmm. Press again or Kma. Press one more time. If he cuts, then you hand and surround everything. His shape is painful. <clears throat> and press again. Even if you cut, you can link under N18 or jump M17. That you should do, M17. Because you're threatening to connect under, you probably force him to... Uh -huh. <clears throat> and now if you connect under, then you can kill S18. Yeah, now you should play O18. Okay, one second. Oh, every time I go to adjust your camera, like the camera changes. So. Really? Sorry, everybody. <laughs> I didn't click on any button on my uh, webcam controller okay. here, but I, I should probably do I, that. <laughs> I don't know if it's just facial recognition or, or what. So. Oh. Okay. Sorry, you were saying. Uh, if you connect O18. He's thinking maybe you're a little bit afraid of dying in the top. But oh, then okay. you're actually looking to jump S18 and it works to kill afterwards. So first you connect, so. make sure you're alive and safe. O18. And actually you're still chasing mm -hmm. that O14 group. That, that group has no eyes. But now it works yeah. to play S18 and then, wow, look at that guy. Push and block. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. So, so just in yeah. case the chat hasn't heard before, like one of our first lessons with Cornell, we were ahead by like 125 <laughs> and I clicked the wrong letter and number combination. That was nice, and, yeah. Yeah, we gave the opponent the game. Only, only one. <laughs> I think you were leading by 100 points, and you you made a 125 points uh, misclick, and lost by 25 <laughs> something like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Roughly, but it happens on Fox. Oh. Huh? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> okay. So opponent's trying to well, come out and live. What the, what's wrong with this? Um, I think I could just Ane on that stone, right? Um, like the M13. You should you should just jump, L12. Uh, okay. If you Ane M13 no. and he blocks N13, you give him some eye shape. 
Like this, you jump, you go out quickly, be safe. He might play at Ariel 10, but who cares? Actually, if you become very strong here, then <clears throat> you can surround uh, the left group, playing B8, no base, a new mm. target. Now he's looking to cut you. But hang on a second, if he cuts and you no B... Ah, okay, cutting it's a problem. Probably it's okay to protect R12. Anyway, you don't have to kill this guy anywhere. Because he died enough on the bottom side, so... Even if he makes one, sure. two, three, four, five groups with two eyes, he's got like 10 points. You have 10 to 15 points in this lower right corner. R2 area, it's more than he's got all over the board. Hmm. Hmm. What's a good shape to protect here? Let's see... <laughs> I can just extend up L10. It looks, it looks better to play K10, because if you go L10, he can push and mm -hmm. cut and use those cuts. So when you play K10, you're connected for sure. Okay. With a new generation of uh, sandbaggers. <laughs> Sounds good. Well, most of the moves you you played or you suggested were very decent and right. And you did a few misclicks when we were about to kill big. <laughs> But that's also fine because uh, otherwise your opponent would just give up. So, you can try to kill the top right, or before you do that, push once in the middle, like M12. <clears throat> And do I want to take the shape point at N10? Um, no, you want to play... Let me see if you hunt and cut. Try, try to kill the top right. Leave the, the middle okay. for now. So hit the vital point. Okay. Let's see what happens here. Hang on a second. <clears throat> wow. Brave. Cut. And thanks for the follow, Sir Skidmore. And I will cut. Cut where right you can now. cut. Or cut early and often. Hmm. Which move next? Not the honey. If you play honey from the outside, he'll go T18 or T17 and it's done. Right. So, um, <clears throat> make him work so more. T17? T no, it would be T18. Yeah. Yeah. If you T17, he'll go T16. Whoa, my, my doggy activates again. <laughs> <laughs> so now... Fuck, fuck, uh, fuck. T14? T14, yeah. The power of empty triangle. <laughs> And then? One more move and he's uh, dead. Oh right, I don't have to Atari, do I? I can just play the Q19. You don't want Atari. If you Atari and he takes three stones, when you play Q19, he makes two eyes. So Q19, just right, play where right. he can uh, make the second eye. And now, again, finally we kill something. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> we kill a second something. <laughs> exactly, yeah. Well, the bottom was dead anyway. The moment he, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. he cut K3, it's finished. J just give me a second, be right back. Sure. <laughs> Cold-blooded indeed. <laughs> I'm so cruel. I think just blocking here. Whoa. 
I can just block this, yeah. right? Right, you have many liberties. Plus, I'm connected all the way out. Yeah. Oh, that's what we're doing. Do you need to defend to this or not? Pop, 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 pop. Mm. That's a nice minus one point move. Yeah, I don't think I do. He, he can't connect. Yeah, and you have many liberties, so <clears throat> chase him a little bit on the left side. Let's see if he dies with another group. Just for the audience. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> P8 looks good. Uh, P for the surround. B B8. Not P, yeah. yeah. Mm. Now he thinks he got you. Yeah, so you have one, two, three, does. four, five, six, seven. He's got four. More got to play by white. Nice. All right, so I don't even have to respond to that, do no. I? Let's keep attacking the left side. Mm. Can he try something? So I guess... White's only option is to try and connect to the top. Yeah, you should you should separate there. Something like G13. Mm -hmm. hmm. Now maybe you can also kill a few stones. Okay. Cut him. Then push one time with G12. Yeah, you can think about killing a few stones in the middle when you start entertain. Ah, that's a pretty good move. Just make shape or harne or what? Um, I guess my shape point would be J12. And that's pretty solid. No, no, J, wait, wait. He played, he played G11. I mean the, the jump. You can do that, but how about you, Hane? H11. Okay. Then you peep. F9. Then you play Atari. F9 to, to threaten the, the cut. Let me make sure I'm... It's a peep kind of play. Okay. Then, oh, that's a good move. But <laughs> not so, so genius, in fact. You can just pull back at D8. You don't need to cut him. Then when he goes uh, C9, you know B, B7. Mm. You don't have to cut him still. You can play B7 anyway. Okay. So he died because you have too many strong wards around. Mm -hmm. If he lives here, it's only when he plays two moves in a row. For example, if he goes E... Ah, okay. <clears throat> Let me see something to make sure he doesn't escape. Oh, he's dead in Gote. Wow, mm -hmm. that's a challenge. Okay, so he's pretty dead. Uh, play the honey in the middle, and 13. And... Well, F11, okay. Atari, and connect. Uh, it's fine, but it's no need. It's actually a move that helps him. Whoa. Push once. O13 and then connect. He connects and he dies with everything. Now M13. Um, so he's only alive right now with the top left corner where he played F18 and with the middle group where you play then six. You play two wrong moves and he live with two places. <laughs> but the rest of the board is good. <laughs> so, so let's see here. If you push out 12 and then you peep, it's pretty dead, huh? Or maybe he's dead in Gote already, but we gotta show him he's really dead. Q11. And then surround everything with something like R7. 
make some points. Okay. End game move. Yeah, when he connected, well, when he connected in the center at P11, he died in Gote. Uh, just block, Q7, kill more, be greedy. <laughs> and block again. And, yeah. and now, no B. Ars, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Peyton's Peyton saying, "How dare we let anything live on the board?" <laughs> <laughs> it was my it was my fault, yeah. y'all. I'm the one that clicked the wrong places. <laughs> You're the one who misclick every kill. <laughs> was it? Uh, yeah. you, I think you can blame it on biomi pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, he can make another eye in the middle or not? Atari Park Park. That's one eye in Gothe. We like Gothe one eye. Probably you should oh. play. You should play Atari uh, L11, and then destroy the eye at O9. Hmm. Yeah, you played all the moves. I was just uh, probably wi whisper. A few a few killing moves from time to time, but you put them down, so not my fault he died so big. Oh, look at this move! Interesting. How to kill? Um, I can. Ah, you know what? And what's nine. interesting? You can you can now kill the other group Be, before you play any move in the middle. Go P6 first. P6. Yeah. <clears throat> he should have resigned. Yeah, because now you can go N5 and kill all. Oh, he's happy to live like that. Finally, N5 kills the original wall. <laughs> Triple checking course. <laughs> Next week I should make some time to uh, invite the followers, watch me play while drinking wine. That that oh, should be interesting idea. and uh, entertaining. And we can beat some uh, Aidan people on uh, uh, W Baduk or Tai Chem or, or even I'll totally Fox. totally watch that. Yeah. So, uh, dun, 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 dun. he's dead in Goth again. <laughs> Yeah, we we so. can call it a uh, wine go night or can be beer. I don't know. We'll see on the mood. Uh, S6. So what do I have or... to do next? Access. So, pom, 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 pom. yeah, S6. If he plays S6 and then he plays S4. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say 6P. It's more like 6, 7 down Europe than 6 down pro. But drinking wine. Helps me become more aggressive and either kill myself big or kill them all over the place. So, <clears throat> uh, yeah, looks like ju I can just Novi here. Just... Okay, the block, the yep. block works too. I was thinking F7 oh, gives you a pretty good shape, but this is fine. Now Novi to the left. <laughs> Romania has good wine and strong players, so it's a it's a fine combination. <laughs> Well, I'm pretty out of shape, I feel, but I don't know. <clears throat> I only played like two tournaments games this year. One where I managed to beat a 6 down on uh, KGS, and the other one where I lost a close game, actually, against a 1 down pro on IGS. In fact, that game I fell asleep at some point and I misclicked. I thought I'm winning all the time, but it happens. Uh, just block, huh? B6. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got some great wine here. And good looking girls. Oh, look at this guy. Uh, I can just capture take, the two take stones. The stones right? yeah. 
<laughs> Friends can't uh, complain about their wines and cheese either. So uh, D D six, yeah. Can he try some Tesuji? Like F eight. <laughs> oh wait, wait, wait a second. How to protect? Uh, I can make the bamboo joint and tiger's mouth at F eight. Yeah, eight. That's a good shape. Instead of playing E eight, which is empty triangle, now you're connected solid. So he lived in the middle and he lives in the top left. It's difficult to count this game. Pull back. Connect. Mm -hmm. No, no fancy uh, opening this game. But the guy died <laughs> in every fight. Finally. Oh, that's <laughs> the end. Good one. You can save it and replay again later. Actually, it saves anyway on the server. So let's let's yeah. see another Fuseki. Uh, so a new game, right? Yeah, go ahead. <clears throat> two handicaps. Fast. Another two stone games. Uh -huh. no, now <laughs> you, now you know what to do. But it's a different six you know. Mm, and he played the horse. Yeah, that's true. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Let me show you my Li Chang Ho fan. Probably see it here. Oh, nice. That can be. Uh, it's a. It's a large one. That's Li Chang Ho's signature. That can be. You know, inspiring. When you use it, you hit your head with a fan every time you misclick. So, <clears throat> um, black to play, huh? R4, Q3, something else, yeah. but no Hoshi. Well, Hoshi can <laughs> okay. be okay, but everybody knows uh, that Joseki is playing Hoshi, so try to confuse him more when you play a 3 4. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and then, then a pincer. <laughs> Whoa. Mm, in this case, you're happy to take a Shimari. P3, O3. Probably a tight one is good enough. Yep. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Yeah, I can just respond with a knight's move. Yeah, C6. Yep. Yeah, the T3 would be a fine option too. Especially that it's very trendy nowadays. Now here, you can block C3, because if he doesn't do anything, you invade H3 right away. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> so you can punish him immediately. H3, and let's see what happens. Interesting question. Uh, every move is for amateurs too. It's just that the outcome will be always different. It's hard to say some moves are only played by down players or high down players and some moves are just pro. So, the thing is that I just, ah, yeah, there are lots of Japanese players. It's a Japanese Go server based in Japan. What to do next to, to help your H3? Let's, let's don't um, lose on time here. Yeah, I was <coughs> looking at K2 or L2. Try K3. Attach, because it, it's a crowd uh, area, so in crowded spaces okay. you want to attach your opponent's stones and make some room. It's like when you're in a crowded uh, mall or something, or in a club, and you use your elbows to, to make some room. H4, go up. Create some cutting points. And then it's uh, Tesuji time. He will block again to surround you. And here, let's see if you find the Tesuji to make some uh, ice space or base and create cutting points. Hmm. 
I could. <clears throat> I mean, I could Hane out and then then push towards G3. Somebody really suggested like F2. That's the move. Uh, How strong are you, Raza Matas? He's he's around my level, if I remember uh -huh. it right. Okay, good move. Because you, you just want to make uh, more room here. So next you can play g3, threatening to cut one way or the other. 15q. 15q <laughs> and 9 down players, they sometimes find the same moves. The only difference is that the 15q doesn't know why he played what he plays. So. Okay. Here you can push one time at e4, but that can wait. And now expand again. Uh, L3. <laughs> You're making room. <laughs> Good. Then, actually you should play e4 once. Gives him a pretty bad shape. And then M2, threatening to connect under. Now here there's something interesting. You can Hane, J5, he cuts, then you go Atari. But then you need to protect, so Atari, Atari, and net. Well, you're alive already. You don't have to play anything. Yeah, so what to do with Sente? It's impressive you managed to live in Sente. Well, you managed <laughs> to live in Sente. <laughs> I didn't even realize it's uh, it's life in Sente, but now... Well, it's okay to play J5 and Atari and then protect and you're fine on the bottom. Because then he goes J6 and there is more Aji. But you can just play somewhere else. Anyway, oh, it's good to, to play this kind of sequence. Yeah, I, I want to the, the Atari The Atari gives him a terrible shape. H6. See, this is the B2 bomber. Painful. And now you need to play J3. Otherwise, he will push and cut and take three stones. Mm -hmm. And then he has to do something. Probably J6. This one. Pa, 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 pa. Wait a second. If he takes one stone, you can still play a Seki. Huh. It's interesting not to answer and go k6, let him have a stone, then leave on the bottom. Ah, yeah, do that. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's happy to capture a stone, but you play h2 and then you play k2. And if he goes for a seki here, it's not a great seki. Now you go k2. Yeah, it looks terrible for him. Now, H1, he'll go L1 and everything. Not a good idea for him. Because when you connect M3, so separate M1. <clears throat> when he goes K1, you play M3. And then you're alive because it's a Seki already. And he had to connect, so you can attack everything. How to. Oh, gosh. Well, the plan um, for this white group is to jump into the middle. Something like M6 or M7 or N7, N6. Right, so, so I should take that yeah, away. Yeah, you should uh, prevent that. N6, it's an option. Because M N, N, Mark? as in nerd. Okay, <laughs> New, <Fair> New York. <laughs> uh -huh, mm -hmm. uh -huh. And now surround. And Ma Michael seven. M M as in masterpiece. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and just block. Yeah, yeah. Well, anyway, that life on the bottom. If you just leave, it's like two or three points. So being seki, it's not a problem. It's you didn't lose right. much. And now extend. <laughs> That sounds like a, like a cocktail from Sir Skidmore. He's preparing something for us. 
three parts bourbon, <laughs> two parts lemon juice, one part simple syrup, a dash of egg whites. J J six. Vigorously. That's that's a cocktail to to help you with a hangover tomorrow morning. J J six here. Yeah. Well, if you just protect H for R, he played here. I think he was afraid of dying with this group, but he's dying with the other one. You know how to kill this uh, N4 in one move? Mm. <laughs> I mean, O2 just does it, right? No, no, because when you play O2, he will try P4 and come out. J just play P4. Oh. He can attach and it's difficult to surround. So when he goes P2, you block you 2 and then that's it. Q2 and game over. Not a sec anymore. The sec he turned to life by killing 100 stones, just like that. So this guy played some kind of Joseki that he failed. Uh, you can pull back once and then block. Oh, so th this is fine too. It's just that those cutting points can be annoying, but you can fight that. You have a ladder on the left when he cuts K7, so no problem. Now you should play N8, he goes Atari, and then you connect P6, and he's committed to, to do something on the right side. Yeah, this Atari you connect, and he has to turn or something. Some beat feeder gene is good, no? Uh, no B, N9, mm -hmm. a, a new target on the horizon. Yeah, this guy can resign already. D did you play any game before we met today? Yeah, I did. I played one game, uh -huh. and it it went pretty well actually. I split. Um, Even game it was? my opponents. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. no, I think it was handicap again. I've had all, all handicap all games handicap. today. It's uh -huh. really weird. Yeah. Interesting. Um, but I split his group and ended up he ki killing him on a pretty large uh -huh. scale. So. Nice. And so I'm and just going to no be again. Yeah. Yep. I try to play peaceful, but these guys, they just overplay, so they are supposed to die. Hey, Klaimu. Hello, Klaimu. What happens here? Puck. Pak, 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 pak. With this move, he wants to cramp R2, but then you connect, he plays Q2, then you play S2, he hane, you go down, or cut. Uh huh. I think you can play one more move here. Like P1. Yeah. It's not really needed, but just to show him it's finished. Maybe he thinks he's still a Seki because he's got one eye and you have uh, that shape with K1, but he's totally wrong. Hmm. We don't know, 6Q. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not too far ahead of me. Wow, this guy played 23,738 games. Oh my solid, gosh. solid 6Q. Aha, uh -huh. and he understood his dead. All right, well done. I let you win some more. And <laughs> if you're around next week, maybe we can meet on Wednesday or Thursday, whenever yeah. is better for you. And then, um, yeah, le let me know later by email. Or... Yeah. All right. Have a good week and have fun killing them more. Awesome. Thank you so much for the lesson. I I definitely learned a lot, and I'll be reviewing Thank this you too. probably before next week. See you next time then. Ciao, ciao. Yeah. All the best. See ya. Bye bye. Bye. So, oh, let me just turn that off. Go back to our regular screen here. Uh, be sure to support Cornell. Be sure to subscribe to his Twitch channel. It sounds like he's going to have an awesome stream. Um,. He's got a webcam, he's set up to do it, so definitely support him. If you want to, if you feel inclined, donate to this channel. I do pay Cornell for his lessons, um, and definitely if you're interested in lessons, 
be sure to contact Cornell because he's a great teacher. I'm learning a lot, definitely the juxtaposition between uh, my intuition and then a six dons intuition uh, helps me learn quite a lot. Yes, he does have a Twitch channel. His Twitch channel is Cornell Go. So I'm not telling you to abandon my channel to go subscribe, but definitely go subscribe and then come back. That would be awesome. <laughs>